Hi, I'm Jim Pickens with First Line Equipment, and today on the Eura Giga 5 Espresso Machine and Automatic Coffee Center, we're going to go over on how to make a ristretto or an espresso, as well as a coffee as noted on the machine, but this coffee is really what they call cafe crema. The difference between coffee and cafe crema is the coffee that's usually made in a regular coffee brewer, the water drips over the espresso grind and then gravity pulls the water through the grind and the oils are extracted from the gravity through the uh, grind. In Cafe Crema, you have a pressurization system. There are two pumps in this machine, two grinders, and when you press the button, you have your coffee grind and the water is pumped through the coffee grind to get a, a superior extraction. And you're going to notice that in the cup of coffee that we make with this machine. So the fir first to start, we'll make a ristretto. We'll put our little cup here. We can push down the spouts. The closer the spouts, the more crema you're going to get when the spouts are closer to the bottom of the cup. If you bring them up here, the crema can tend to break more when it's too high. So you want to bring this down nice and close. On the display, you'll see on the first uh, screen it says ristretto, espresso, coffee, hot water, cappuccino, latte macchiato, one portion milk, one portion milk foam. Um, and basically you can get into other beverages on the display. Here we'll make a ristretto. And I'll press that button right there. As you can see, there are four beans in the picture here. It says volume, a half ounce. And also on the display, you'll see it says 50-50. What this does, it's actually, this machine can take 50% of the beans from one grinder and 50% of the beans from the other and mix them to make your beverage. And as you see here, it says about 0.75 uh, right there, but there's a lot of crema in this espresso because these are freshly roasted beans. The next beverage we're gonna make is the cafe crema and we'll just lift this up a little bit and bring it back down and we'll press the coffee button and here it's again 50 50 four beans that's the amount of coffee or they know known as coffee strength and here the volume is going to be five ounces and you'll start seeing a lot of crema on this cup of coffee Lift up the spouts, and you have a ton of crema there. And this is what's known as cafe crema. Now, if you wanted to make cafe americano, you can grab your cup with your espresso shot. You can add hot water, and of course, it says fill water tank at this point. Irregardless, we'll move on to the next thing. We get into the program menu by hitting the P button on top, and there's five pages on one to five, and we have two to five right there. And here we'll hit expert mode. In this mode, we can program these beverages. So say we didn't like the five ounces of coffee that came out. We can hit the coffee button, and we can change the volume by pressing this button here. And then you'll see a minus sign and a plus sign related to those two keys and say we want four ounces. 4.5 will actually be the lowest on this uh, setting for this um, menu option. We hit save. Coffee strength. Here you have, we have four beans when we made the coffee. If we want less ground coffee, we can lower the amount of coffee being ground or we can increase it. This will enhance the flavor by increasing it and make the coffee stronger. We hit the save button. Temperature. 
typically what I've seen is all the settings are high on the beverages on this machine and one thing I do like about the Giga 5 by tasting the coffee it's actually one of the hottest beverages that come out of a super automatic and typically that is a complaint on a lot of super automatics that the temperature is not high enough on this machine it does seem to be hotter than others and we, if we don't want to say we don't want to say this we can hit the return key now the grinder one feature that I really like we can increase this bean hopper to a hundred percent which is our decaf or we can increase the other side to a hundred percent which is our regular mocha java blend or we can get in between 25 75 50 50 or 75 25 really really nice feature if you want to blend two coffees together in the same brew hit save there and if you don't like the settings that you program and you want to go back to the factory automatically programs the factory settings and as you can see the volume went back down or up to five get out of program mode hit the return return back hit the program button on top and we're back to fill our water tank. Hopefully this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Thank you.